if he would custom make a Ganesh tree for me. He agreed and in just a few minutes he'd made an amazing idol right before my eyes. I thought to myself, why not go out looking for people with unusual talents? Perhaps they could do something special for this show. So when I flew back to Bombay, I tracked down my old pal Anu Malik. He's written the songs for some of the biggest Bollywood blockbusters over the last 20 years. I've seen Anu compose before. He's an instinctive composer. Put him before a harmonium or a keyboard and he'll just pluck a tune out of the air. Okay, so we finally run Anu down to ground. He's in a studio in North Bombay. He's recording a song. You'll probably hear people shouting and singing and playing instruments in the background throughout the sequence, but then that's what things are like in a studio. We're going to ask him a little bit about how he composes, and then the big thing, we're going to get him to compose a tune for me. You've been composing for how long, Anu? I've been composing for the last, uh, say, about 28 years. So what? You just go to a producer and you'd hum the tune yourself? And I just run out of the producer because they had no time. Obviously. Right. And just make a song. I start humming it there. How would you do this? I just tell you I remember a song. For example, any word, there are two words you I would write the word. Now I had no situation. Right. So the, the guy just stopped because he liked the way I da 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 da. He liked the melody. But he said, your words can. I said, no, sir, please. Because you wouldn't understand the da ra ra ra. So I said, Tum kya mile? Anything. I would just hum any tune, any word that came into my heart. Remember the good old days when there'd be this 60 piece orchestra with violins and cellos? Asha ji would come in or Lata ji would come in and they'd do this song and it'd be just done in one take. Those things don't happen today. Mm -hmm. uh, when I was recording a song, I remember we had 60 violins, 4 violas, 4 cellos, ensemble of chorus, 30 chorus. There was plucking instruments on one side, 6 dholaks on one side. And the conductor said, one, two, three, four, and the singer. And he just went for it. Eh? I remember the song Bazi, we were doing it. There used to be a tape there. And when I was singing, I mean, the singer was singing, Bazi gar, oh, Bazi gar. And I love the track so much. And somebody comes and says, don't no, okay, it's the tape, tapes run out. And I was shattered. I started mm -hmm. crying. I said, what are you saying? Because then the singers, the musicians had to play the whole. And you had to get that magic again, no? All of them had to be perfect. But luckily I got it because it worked better the second time because we gave it a better shot. Okay, now let me tell you what we're here for. I need you to compose a song and I want you to do it now in front of the camera with no preparation. The songs, well, let's see. Well, about India, let's take a song about... Because the program is about how you can do everything custom-made and specially in India. So let's do a song that captures the sense of that. But I want it to be smooth. I want it to be sort of soothing. But you know, I could listen to whenever I traveled, whatever. Mm. That's nice. <laughs> That is actually quite a haunting number. Yeah, and you put some words, what's it? Tum se aaj milke yu laga ke ye sara jaha mil gaya That's very nice. Kal hum phir na mile to ghabra na na tum o jaane ja kyun ke aaj mile tum se Whatever. Yeah, okay. Tuba.com